My name is Robert Worcester. I'm a mechanical engineer from Panama City, Florida. I've grown up around motorsports my entire life, and there's always been fast cars in the driveway. That's why I went to engineering school, was to figure out why they were fast and what made them the best cars. Um, so really, that passion's just been there my whole life. Hi, I'm Robert. Yeah, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thanks for taking the time to talk with me today. To be a race engineer, I think the first thing is to be motivated, to uh, have good skills of uh, communication, have a good uh, team spirit. So you said we're walking the track, going to get the distance and compare that to the simulator. Um, what happens if it's off? Like, what happens if the simulator well, is different? Well, we adjust in reality, and uh, it's also to have an historic of the mileage for uh, every uh, part and uh, tires. So going over the track walk with Pierre, um, I learned how their simulations need to be compared with the real life track. We were looking at potholes and bumps and the crown in the road because it's a road course, so it's very different than a regular track. It's not perfect. So they were looking for anything that could upset the, truck, the car during the race. There's a lot of unique challenges because uh, you, have no, you, know, you have no runoff. Mm -hmm. uh, we have very little practice time and uh, the track's gonna evolve pretty quickly. So the relationship between the engineer and the driver is extremely important. The engineer obviously has a lot of tools at his disposal to improve the car, to change the car setup. So that's what, at the end of the day, makes or breaks a winning team. all about the data at the end of the day. They're able to take so much data and have so much information from the races that they can really make accurate changes for the next race. It still is my dream job to be a race engineer. Probably even more so now that I see how entailed it is and how involved they are. It's very interesting.